it's it's obvious this game was lost on the defensive end for us. <clears throat> I mean, offensively, we scored pretty easily, except for that third quarter. We didn't score for the first five minutes of it. Um, you know, and you can't play defense against a team like that that can really shoot the ball well. Um, they out-rebounded us 40 to 28. And, you know, when it was crunch time and we had to put the ball in the basket, we didn't. We had to get our stops. We didn't. You know, and it came down to those last five minutes of play. We didn't come up with big-time plays, and they did. And, you know, hopefully it's a learning lesson for us that, you know, you got to play for the 40 minutes. The first two quarters, if you looked at the stats, it was unbelievable on both teams. You know, everybody was really shooting the ball, and, you know, everything was going in. But we just got cold. They changed our defense. We struggled. We turned the ball over a few times, and then... You know, once they got their lead, they were really going to give it back to us. And we never got the stops that we needed, whether it was they hit a three, they penetrated, they hit the layup and fouled, or we fouled them on the screen and roll. And, you know, we just didn't get any stops at all. So you can't live like that. This team had two seniors, <coughs> um, and they, they just decided to really come and have big-time big time games. Their PTPers were two seniors, and they, they just dominated us the whole entire time. Yeah, I was really surprised because we – gave them hope in the beginning of the game by giving them open looks. So they got their confidence and then, you know, the rim came as, as big as an ocean to them. So it's it's a matter of you can't let someone have all that time to look at the rim and they're really good shooters. We know that, that Roberts is a great shooter. You know, she was leading the conference this year and last year in shooting. So obviously you give her open looks, she's going to put them down. And, you know, that's what happened. And then they got their confidence, but we just could never really get stops consistently it's definitely a learning experience um you know it's it's really hard to that we pride ourselves on defense so i mean it's really hard for us to come into a game and not play defensive like defensively wise very well and you know it's something that we pride ourselves on it's, it's kind of embarrassing almost so um it was difficult you know she was a big body out there but um i just i, I feel like i just didn't adjust to her the way that i should have i should have uh adjusted to her style of play so I could play better defense against her. And, uh, you know, like Bailey says, a learning experience. So we'll take this and for the next game. Oh, well, we did have about three or four possessions that we came up with nothing. They changed defenses three times on us, and we made that adjustment. And we either turned the ball over or just didn't really get a good shot at the basket. And, you know, obviously at the end, four times the ball went in and out for us. We just did not get that roll. But you have to put that down in that situation. And we didn't. Um, you know, we turned the ball over two times with travels and, you know, but it's just no break came our way tonight. Well, I mean, they're, they're, um, you know, the first teamers, they're big time players. So, you know, we knew it and they're seniors, but they still have to, we went over their scout. We knew what offense they were going to run. We knew what was going to happen, but, you know, we did contain Robertson at the end there a little bit. We slowed her down, but, you know, and I think she went like one for 12 shooting. But we didn't get Beetle. Beetle just had a field day on us. When you go seven for ten, and I know that she had double double rebounds. Um, yeah, she had 18 rebounds. How can you give up 18 rebounds? You know, that's uh, that's that's the game right there. She scores 20 points and have 18 rebounds on us. And if you really look at her her stats, yeah, she turned the ball over six times. But you know, she just is a, a tough player to really defend there. And now when we go on the road to play them at their place, she's even better at home. She is even better at home. So, you know, we have to figure out a way to really put a stop on those two kids. Well, yeah, of course. It's just that, you know, we're not getting those big-time points out of our two seniors like, you know, our opponents do. So, you know, we're, we're still young. Our kids are going to learn from this experience. And, you know, it's still all the freshmen and sophomores that get the, the, the work done tonight. So, you know, we, we just got to know what it feels like. And, and we go on the road and have a tough game on Saturday, and then they come back and play us again with Abilene, who's first in the conference at 6-0. and And, you know, we got to try to get in there and get an upset on the road and at home. And we can do it. We have the talent to do it.